In this demo, we'll have a look at the sophisticated continuous data protection capabilities of the Acronis CyberProtect Cloud. So let's get started. Continuous data protection is a truly innovative feature from Acronis that allows you to seamlessly backup even minor changes of selected data between scheduled backups on a continuous basis. This allows you to significantly reduce the number of full and incremental backups required to protect a customer's machine, and as a result, to dramatically decrease the server load. You can track the files modified by specific applications. For example, your customer is a small company which has been frequently creating and updating their Word documents. They want to make sure that even minor changes of their documents are not lost. Thus, you can enable tracking of Microsoft Word for that customer. Alternatively, you can track the changes of specific folders or files on the customer's machine, which are frequently updated and critical for that customer's business continuity. Let's have a look at the Acronis CyberProtect Cloud in action. In this demo, we will consider the case of application tracking. Thus, navigate to Devices and select the desired customer's machine. Press the Create Plan button in the right pop-up panel and expand the backup module and enable Continuous Data Protection. In this section, Items to Protect Continuously, select Microsoft Word from the list of predefined applications. Alter the remaining backup settings if needed and press the Create button. Press the Run Now button to initiate the backup process manually. As soon as it's over, navigate to Backup Storage and browse through the latest backup that was just created. Navigate to Devices and select the customer's machine. In the right pop-up panel, click on Connect via HTML5 Client and establish a remote connection with the customer's machine. Navigate to the local folder specified in the Continuous Data Protection settings, create a new Word document using Microsoft Word application, and save it. Quit the remote connection session. Navigate to Backup Storage and open the latest backup. As you can see, the Word document that you just created is already seamlessly integrated into the existing backup. And no new backup is created. 